Hello YouTube, this is Nocturnal and I'm coming to you all with um, kind of like the review and a how to of this new Conquer Online uh, binary server exploit that has been coded by Ultimation, a member at. Uh, okay, I, I don't think I'm actually give out that kind of information, but anyway, um, basically. This was meant to be a four botters exclusive. Like I'm making this video for the four botters community. But if you happen to stumble up across this, and you're in a conquer servers, then you know, and kudos and good job for you. So let's get started. Um, first of all, what this is is this tool that Ultimation has coded is called the Account Exploiter, and what it does is okay I'm not exactly sure <laughs> what it does but um, basically is what it's meant to do is it is meant to uh, you put in oh you know what I'll just show you it's gonna be a lot easier so first you need to be uh, making sure that you the client you're trying or the server you want to use this for is a 5065 or 5095 binary server chances are if it's 5065 or 5095 like the patch is one of these two then it's probably a binary server because uh, as far as I know not many people are using sources that are that low anymore but um so yeah first um what I do is I start the client and here there is a play uh, this is like the play.exe that most servers use but I just created a shortcut and I'm using the black null argument to skip past the play.exe if you don't know what that is that's okay just open it like normal and um, now it says to open it first but I do it this way because I don't really think it has any bearing on what happens so once you have your client open you go to your account exploiter open up account exploiter.exe wait till it says it's in wait till it says it's injected into target and then once that happens you put in a random seed and I honestly don't know what number you should put in I don't even know what number I should put in myself um, he didn't leave any documentation whatsoever other than saying quote put in a random number and you know like that's really ambiguous and I have no idea what number to put in like I don't know if negative five would be okay or like 99 trillion or whatever that number is like I have no idea I'm guessing it's just any uh, integer and in programming terms that's anything between like a really large negative number and a really high positive number so if you don't know what to put in and you're having a hard time I saw uh, Ultimation's video he put in an eight digit number and that got him the PM account um, I don't know if that works for every server but what I have done is I've created a little bit of an add-on for this and right off the bat I have to say without Ultimation and his coding of this program my add-on wouldn't even be possible and secondly my add-on isn't really even that great I mean all it does is it has two modes you can generate a number copy it and then paste it or a feature I've added in is an auto generate feature and what that does is it generates a number every so many seconds it's like 1.7 uh, one nine seconds so to get like a unique number because yeah you don't need to know that's just that when I generate a number I'm having it generate using a seed and if you don't know what this is that's okay uh, but for those of you who know what this is I'm having it generate based off of a seed of the milliseconds of your clock so that's why I have it uh, generating as such a weird like number of seconds like 1.7 one nine or whatever so just to get a unique number every time but anyway I'm talking too much and um, yeah so what this does is it auto generates a number and it auto copies it so you know if you don't know what number to pick just whoops I actually copied that my bad just paste in a number once it auto generates type in any password 
any username, so he says, and click log in. And wait and hope. That's all you're doing is you're hoping. And for me, I have had no success whatsoever, but maybe eventually I'll get success. Now, if this screen comes up, this means I'm guessing it didn't work. So once that happens, if your auto generator is running, do you just simply go back to this window and click paste and you'll have a new number and you try again. And that's really all there is to it. Um, yeah, I mean, like, if you're wondering about any viruses or anything, this, my add-on, does not have a virus. As far as I know, that server did not have a, uh, the server's client did not have a virus. This binary server account exploiter, or exploiter, does not have a virus. And if you want to be, uh, like, extra sure, and, like, sure that none of these have a virus, I'll include, uh... I don't know, I might include a scan report or some something like that or a website where you can scan the files yourselves or anything, but um, be warned that uh, his account exploiter, it might say that it's a virus or something because um, it's an exploit and many, many exploits end up giving off false positives. And that means it looks like a virus to the computer, but it's really not, it's harmless and it's, you know, just a normal program. So yeah, I try. I meant to make this video shorter, but that's pretty much about it. And uh, yeah, like I said, um, I'll have a link for this in the description. Um, you'll have to go to the forum for botters, which it'll be in the description. And if you're not a member, you will have to sign up to download this. But the forum is awesome, so I highly recommend you sign up for it. And for those of you at Four Botters who are going to complain about how weak my uh, number generator is like I did I did this because I have free time on my hands and it, it's a it's a helpful tool like even if you don't think it is it really is I mean especially if you're unsure what number to use having something that auto generates a number for you to use and all you do is paste it every time then uh, that's it oh one thing I did forget to mention um, with this tool if by chance you get a number like this and you enter it and you log in and it works you want to save this number because that's going to be the seed that you can put in at any time to let you log into that account again and in order to do that if you're running my auto generator and you and this number works turn off my auto generator copy this number and then like open notepad or something paste it in here and then like say you know like super duper PM like the name of the character that you get into okay and um, this tool is really powerful <coughs> excuse me um, like honestly this could be used to ruin servers just because like the PM can do so many things and it's so important that yeah you could literally ruin a server with this and um, I'm not gonna say whether I am or am not but yeah you can do that so keep that in mind and just you know with power comes responsibility and all that bullshit so yeah again thank you Ultimation for creating this unique tool and yeah so that's it I will catch you later, YouTubers.